What we've been doing is looking at the data, and we know that police somehow manage to de-escalate, disarm, and not kill white people every day. So what's going to happen is we are going to have equal rights and justice in our own country, or we will restructure their function and ours. Actor and activist Jesse Williams was awarded with the Humanitarian of the Year Award at the BET Awards last night, giving a powerful speech that has a lot of people talking this morning. Some of the biggest stars in entertainment were in L.A. last night for the annual BET Awards. Beyonce opening up the show with a surprise performance of the song Freedom from her Lemonade album. She brought out rapper Kendrick Lamar for the performance. Several tributes to Prince and Muhammad Ali also took place during the show. The show concluded with a performance by Prince collaborator Sheila E., who held up a guitar in, in tribute of the late artist. And this morning, everyone is talking about the fashion. Here today to talk about some of the best and worst dressed is fashion insider Stacy Michelle. Stacy, thank you so much for being hey, here. Hey, yes. Great. All right, so a lot of very fashionable people last night. Yes. Uh, beginning with Chloe and Hallie. Yes, yes. These two YouTube sensations have been blowing up. They okay. recently signed with Beyonce, so they're part of the Beehive. And that's now. a big deal. That's a really big yes, deal. Yes, okay. and they'll actually be on tour with her starting um, in Europe. So um, I love these girls because they're bringing this fun and daring look. You know, their first look you see there, she's got stripes. Her yep. sister's got ruffles, two trends that are huge happening right now. Um, but they're bringing in that color and that funk that's just a and little bit different. And kind edgy. of putting their own twist on it. I like that. Yes, you know, yes. When you're branding yourself as an artist like that, you right. have to, right? Yeah, setting the trend for their age group. And I just love it. It's romantic, it's fun, it's bohemian, it's just a little bit of everything. Right. And I love it. All right, and then let's move on. So, Megan Good, also a big talker. Yes, so Megan Good, you know, she always likes to bear a little bit of skin. Love that dress. But, you know, I love this emerald green cutout mm -hmm. dress that she's wearing. Looks Beautiful um, love this on her. I think anybody could pull this off and rock it, but she's got the curves for it. This is by a designer called Lorena Sarbu. Um, one thing I'm not too fan of, a, it, is not too slip? fan of, is her hair. Oh, her hair. I you was know, say I just slip. wish she would have done maybe just a little something different with it, whether she, she braided have. her, mm -hmm. you know, locks or something. But, uh, but overall, she looks great. Yeah, the green I agree. looks amazing on her skin. The dress is outstanding. All right, and, and so moving on, Janelle Monet. Yes, Janelle Monet is no stranger to a best dress. Right. She constantly comes out rocking uh, her minimalistic wow. look. You always mm -hmm. see her in black and white, but she really embraces this look and makes it edgy and her own. So she's wearing this uh, assassin vibe. Is that leather? Fabulous. Um, it's sequins. Sequins, So it's okay. a black and white striped right. sequins. Uh, and by assassin vibe, she gave tribute to uh, Prince by wearing this. Her nails are purple. Her rings are purple. And she also Everything did about an amazing performance during the show, too. So uh, she looks great countlessly every time. The red lip, her signature, just outstanding. All right, this next artist, Maya, making a huge comeback. Maya, this look is like, whoa. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, Maya, where have you been? Yes, uh, this look is from designer Christian Siriano, and it's a mix of uh, a crop top, a cape, a pant, a dress. Mm -hmm. uh, if they show the full look of it there, it's it's quite um, great. Uh, just love her. She actually released an album this year. She's had a tour, who knew? She was yeah. on tour between February and June, promoting her Smooth Jones mm -hmm. album. Uh, so she's just rocking it, you know. Hopefully it's nice she'll... to see her back. She was really big when I was like in high school and early college. Right, and right. I haven't heard about her for a really long time. So yeah, so she's it's nice doing, to see her back on the scene. She's coming back and looking good while right. she's doing it. All right. So who else? Who else are we talking about? This All right. Morning? Next up is Yara Shahidi, and she just looked outstanding in this uh, rainbow sequins again, yeah. just like Monet sequins Tracy Reese dress. Beautiful. And I love it just for the total package. Her hair looks great, tossed to the side. Uh, the dress is very youthful it's fun and I was gonna embraces. say it's almost a little casual but not but you know it has flair to it yeah so. the sequins kind of pop it up a mm -hmm. little bit and then her shoes just complete the whole look there so I think she looks great in this she's um, of course the co-star with Tracy Reese and Anthony Anderson right. who are hosting the show uh, so she's just blazing her own trail setting her trends and looking great while at it now there is one that made the worst list really let's 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 there take a look there is one so <laughs> there's always one there's always one yeah. so she was a top model but she did not top this list okay Eva Marcel did not oh, look Eva. good in this look um, this look is from Yaz Couture 
for uh, independent designer, but you know, it's just way too short. Way too short, and uh, the pattern's the not even pattern, catchy. pattern, you know, florals in, but not here. Mm -hmm. She's got the choker. She's trying to rock that trend, okay. but it's not working there either. Her hair, again, she could have done just a little bit more. Yeah. Um, and then the shoes, you know, the chunky heel, it works, but this whole outfit in total just did not make it. So. All righty. Well, Stacey Michelle, <laughs> thank you for joining us again.